Today, I'm going to show you how to use a wait for functionality in testing. There might be instances where you want to wait for a certain event to occur before taking the next step in your flow. It can be a wait for display an event, uh, an element, wait for some text to display, simply wait for a few seconds, or any other reason for which the wait is required. Test team has a built-in capability to help you with that. Testing provide various uh, wait for features. All of them can be found in, in the main menu of the predefined steps. Just click on the menu, go to wait for, and you will find here various uh, wait for features. You can wait for an element to be visible on the page. You can wait for element to disappear from the page. You can wait for specific element text. You can wait for your document to be download it completely, or you can just sleep for a certain amount of seconds or minutes. You can also write your own JavaScript-based logic for custom waiting. Let me show you a few examples of how you can utilize those features. Let's take an example of a wait for element visible. So once again, go ahead, access the menu, go to wait for, wait for element visible, and simply choose the relevant element on the screen. This is my object. This is the element that I would like to wait for. Click on it, and you will have a new step, which is basically waiting for a specific item to appear on the screen. This is my element that I am waiting for. Sometimes you would like to maybe change the, the element that you were initially recorded. So in order to do so, you just go ahead to the properties, reassign, and simply choose a different element on the screen. OK, you can do the same for uh, to wait for some element text. OK, once again, assuming you would like to plug in your step over here, access the main menu, go to wait for, wait for element text, and just, again, choose the relevant element on the screen. You can use a sleep functionality to when you want to wait a few seconds between the steps. OK. Also here, go ahead, open the end menu, wait for, and choose the sleep feature. The default sleep time is one second, but you can always access the properties and manually change it to, let's say, three seconds. Thank you very much.